Can you tell us about the conditions of these detention centers? Well, what I can say is the following: like, like res the, lots of of, uh, of uh, international uh, aid workers have said, it's like hell in Libya for migrants. Uh, they have nowhere to go, uh, even if they try to flee Libya uh, uh, through the Mediterranean. They are caught and brought back to Libya. Uh, you have uh, force working over there; they force them to work. They uh, even we have accounts from migrants in Tajura. Yesterday, they told us like several of them. They used to be uh, they were uh, inscripted to work for the militias in the warehouses, in the ammunition warehouses, uh, cleaning weapons, etc., etc. It's 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 not that uh, that good for these people over there. It's uh, the 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 living conditions are horrible, and uh, no uh, hope. I, for them, for the migrants themselves, as they tell us every day, like they don't feel any hope over there in Libya. And, uh, and uh, for example, also another thing is, uh, today uh, we were following up on the story of yesterday's uh, attack against the center um, most of the of the uh, relief agencies in libya they said literally even though the strike has happened but so far there is no plan of ev evacuating anybody from there like Sh sharif uh, not a very long time ago i spoke to the un uh, missions head in libya roberto mignone we did an interview with him on france 24 and he was saying that the idea is to deter more and more migrants from flocking to Libya, given that these conditions are so horrible. From what you're hearing from those on the ground, what more should be done, if you can tell us briefly, by the international community to try and improve these horrific conditions? Well, it's 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 been talked about like daily. Uh, let's 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 take it like this. Uh, you have uh, the the European Union. Of course, they have a responsibility uh, towards what's, whatever is happening in the uh, in Libya. You have the UN. Of course, they have also a great Lots responsibility. Of talks, but no Lots action. of talks, yeah. but no actions so far. So um, hopefully, something will will happen for these people. I